I don't know if you saw the game against New York when he got bumped off the ball. He went in to try and body the guy off, and I saw it come when I stood up. I was like, no, no. He beat three defenders, which was amazing. And then he touched it long, and then there's a center back that was coming over, and he was running like this. And he rolled over, and he was just on his back like this. But this is Mane on the move for the Whitecaps. He's got fresh legs, Holgerson. And it was too funny. <laughs> I have it on my phone, <laughs> like, saved. Me One, like two, three. It hits him. Oh! <laughs> Body, funny. son. Hey. He said, oh, it was funny, it was funny. And he's been in the weight room ever since then. He's trying to get stronger. If you want to play soccer, you got to stick to it, and you got to do what you got to do to get better. I one day want to be a professional soccer player. That was the plan when I was in Gambia. In Gambia, there's lots of good players. So I think that's one motivation that I had when I was a kid. In Gambia, everybody plays soccer all the time. It was easier to get mixed with friends and like have pickup games. The fields, they're not good. They're like dirt fields. They're like bumps and there are holes in them. We get some quality balls, but not all the time. Sometimes the balls are like really not good. Yeah, I miss it a lot. Like here people get their own stuff that they do. Like in Gambia it's different. We do stuff like as a group. We have like a local, like a town tournament. I was lucky to be a part of it because I was like probably the youngest player in there. I was 13, so you can see the comments. Some people call me Gambian Messi. Mariama Jame. That's a common name in Gambia, Mariama. I think that's the only picture I have of her. It was a pretty sad day, I can't remember. I'm still sad thinking about her. I thought it was a great opportunity for me to go and showcase my talent and show other people what I can do besides the Gambian people. They've already seen what I can do. I went and picked him up at the airport. And so there were a couple of boys. We had two boys at first, him and a boy named Anwar. Yeah, they were shy. They welcomed us. We felt really comfortable around them. I thought he fit in pretty quickly. He's a very kind of go with the flow kind of kid. They wanted to help me to succeed in life. Even soccer doesn't work out for me, I can do some other stuff. They were going to be sending him back to Gambia, and I wasn't real thrilled with that idea. We asked him, you know, if he would like to stay, and he, he, he wanted to, so then we went from there. When are you going to start studying? Mm, I think it was said, like, August. August. So in two August months? First. What? First. Yes. Mom, you're killing yes, no, You're killing me. Right. We're really close because that's the kind of passion I am. If you do a lot for me, I gave it back to you. After he stayed with us for a while, we fell in love with him and uh, decided to bring him into our family. Love y'all. Okay. Love you. Have a good night. You too. Bye. He used to do lots of tricks. That's all I used to do, but I didn't focus on it anymore. It's exciting to work with a player with the talent that Gukuta's got. He needs to keep learning about the game. He needs to improve on that aspect of where he should be when he doesn't have the ball, where he should be when certain players are in certain positions. If he grew up in England, for example, from the age of 10, he would have been in a, a, an organized youth system, probably at a big club. And he would have learned every day where he should be tactically. 
but that's something that we have to teach him and, and hopefully he can take on board. He came on against FC Dallas. We were 2-0 down, and that really changed the game. And there's going to be a substitution coming here for Vancouver, but we'll see 18-year-old Kakuta Mane go in from Gambia. I was excited, and I went in. Last year in Austin for the Austin Aztecs. My first touch was in that grade. I crossed it, it went out, out of bounds. Kakuta Mane couldn't get his foot around it. It didn't do anything with my confidence. It was still there. And um, the second touch was better. And the third touch uh, happens to be the goal. It was, it was pretty far, but I knew definitely I was going to do something with that. The young lad, 18-year-old Kakuta Mane. If you play against After me, that's what you're going to get. I'm just going to run at you all day. Mane with pace. A lot to be played. Kakuta Mane. Mane past Woodbury. Mane in front. And another goal. An equalizer. I was really excited to play. And um, everybody was asking me, are you nervous? I was like, no, I'm not. I mean, this is what I've been waiting for all my life. Just watch me play.